everybody, it's Paige, and today's video is going to be a little bit different than my normal videos. I decided to film a day in the life of vlog. I've had so many requests to film one of these, and I thought it would be kind of interesting, hopefully, <laughs> to bring you guys along with me and show you what a typical day in my life is like. I just got out of the shower. It's time to get ready for the day. So, if you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy, and let's go ahead and get started. So now that I've done my hair, my skincare, all of that, it's time for me to go pick out my OOTD. So I actually have something a little special planned for this. You guys are getting a little sneak peek of our apartment today, but I ordered a ton of stuff from ThreadUp, so I thought I would do an unboxing and try-on haul of a bunch of the stuff that I got. I wanted to say thank you so much to ThreadUp for partnering with me on today's video. ThreadUp is the largest online thrift store. They've got brands such as Madewell, Lululemon, Free People, and you can save up to 90% off of the original retail price. Instead of spending a lot of time going through racks and racks of clothing at a typical thrift store, you can customize your search and it's super easy to find what you're looking for on ThreadUp. You can filter by size, brand, style, or color, which saves a lot of time. They also add thousands of new items every single day, so the thrill of the hunt is still there. Also, everything is triple checked for quality and lots of pieces actually still have their tags on them. I am personally a fan of ThreadUp because I love online shopping. Also, in times like these, we're all trying to our homes as little as possible so it's perfect and thrifting is a much more affordable and environmentally conscious way to shop. You're already saving a ton of money by shopping on ThreadUp but they're actually offering a special discount. You can click the link in my description box and use code PAGE for an additional 30% off your order. I cannot wait to show you guys everything that I got. I got some awesome deals. So yeah, all the info will be linked in the description box and let's go ahead and get into the unboxing. So here we have our first package. I freaking love the post polka dot tissue paper. The presentation is everything. Isn't this seriously the cutest? It says gold digging since 2009. Hashtag secondhand first. So this is the first piece that I picked out. It is an oversized sweater from Old Navy. I had fallen mine when I was shopping on the website. The original retail price of this was $33, but the thread up price is only $11.99. I love the colorful speckled detailing that it has, and it honestly feels brand new. Next, we have this super cute dress. The style is perfect for fall. I love that it has longer sleeves, and I think the color is gorgeous. The material is super soft, but it's lightweight enough to be able to wear this during fall in Florida, so I thought this would be a nice transitional piece. This is from the brand Pink, and it originally retails for $48, but the thread up price was $19.99. I could not get over how cute this packaging is. There's a ton of items in this box. The first one being this super cute denim skirt. I haven't had a denim skirt in so long and they're really trendy and cute. I thought this one was a nice medium wash and it's from Topshop, which is a brand that I freaking love. This was originally $64, but I got it from ThreadUp for $20.99. Next we have this super cute pink cardigan, again from Old Navy. I love Old Navy. I feel like their pieces are just so universal and you can like mix and match them with anything. Um, and this one was so cute. Again, a great transitional piece for fall here in Florida. My favorite color, pink. This originally was $37, but I got it for $13.99. Next, I picked out this super cute kind of taupey nude scarf. It's nice and lightweight. I thought this would look really cute with a lot of the pieces that I ordered from the website. So um, I thought this would be like a nice little accessory. And it was only $7.99, originally $24. Next, I picked out a pair of jeans. I cannot wait to try. Those 
those on. We've also got another super cute sweater in this kind of like mustardy color. This is actually from Madewell, which is a really expensive brand. This originally retails for $98. Yes, $100 for a sweater, but the thread up price was only $30.99 and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna spoil myself and buy myself a Madewell sweater. Moving on to the largest and final box. I have another sweater here from Topshop. Pink is my favorite color, like I said, and this was a nice oversized sweater. I thought this would be cute with like that jean skirt or some shorts. This was originally $72, but I got it for $15.99. We have another dress here. I used to wear dresses all the time, but I can't tell you the last time I wore a dress. This one is from Old Navy. It's originally $42, and I got it for $20.99, which is literally 50% off. It feels brand new. It's so soft. I love the color. It's perfect for fall. Love the sleeve length, and this is actually a nice length of a dress. Like It's not too long to where it hits awkwardly, but it's definitely not going to be too short. I thought this little old navy short sleeved kind of sweater thing was really cute. It again has like that little speckled detailing. This one isn't colorful like the other one, but this was only $12.99 from ThreadUp and it's originally $25. Like I said, I love old navy, so I got a ton of their stuff. This was another super exciting piece. This is from Calvin Klein and I hope you guys are going to be able to tell, but there's like little silver threading throughout this. It's so adorable. I got this for $14.99 and it originally retails for $70. It's a nice long sleeve. I love the little bell sleeves at the end. I might wear this today. I don't know, but it's really cute. I think this will be super cute with jeans. And then the very last item is again from Madewell. This is the most exciting item in my opinion. This is from Madewell. This was originally $149 for a denim jacket, but it was only $46.99 on ThreadUp and it literally looks brand new. I don't even know if this has ever been worn. It's in pristine condition. I love the darker denim wash. It's just a nice plain clean denim jacket that I thought would go with literally anything so this was like my splurge item I'm gonna go ahead and pick out an outfit to wear and then we will continue on with our long list of things to do today so I decided to go with the old navy short sleeve top along with the jeans that I picked out it's pretty warm out today so I figured this would be like a nice cute comfy outfit and it's nice enough to wear outside but also comfy enough to wear around the house I am so happy with how all of the pieces turned out. I had such a great experience with ThreadUp. I definitely will be using them in the future. Make sure you guys click the link in my description box and use code PAGE for an additional 30% off your order. So 30% off all of the prices that I mentioned today. That's literally insane. <laughs> all the info will be down below. I've got some chores that I have to do today. I have to do the dishes. I have to do laundry. I have to go get lunch. I also actually just got this new book. I am so excited about it. This is Midnight Sun by Stephanie Meyer. This is basically a retelling of Twilight, but from Edward's perspective instead of Bella's. I just finished reading Twilight last night. It took me two days. <laughs> And this book is even longer, so I'm gonna try to read today because I've been so excited about this. I ordered it from Target, um, but yeah, super exciting. Let me know if you guys have read this in the comments down below.
All right, so I have to turn the AC on. Oh, not that much, just like a little bit because it is so hot. My car says it's 100 degrees outside. <laughs> no joke, that's insane. Um, so I'm actually on my way to Chick-fil-A to go get us some lunch. Um, and then I'm gonna come back here, do a couple more things. Um, I have to go to my PO box later, so that'll be exciting. Um, but yeah, basically on weekdays, I'm pretty much by myself most of the day. Jarvis, my boyfriend, works at home um, or works from home. Um, um, but he's like in his office all day working um, and then once he gets off around five then we like spend more time together but uh, for like the daytime daytime I pretty much just do things on my own um, so yeah we're gonna go pick up some Chick-fil-a I am so excited and then uh, yeah I'm starving I haven't eaten anything today and it's already 1:53. So I just finished eating lunch and switched over the laundry. At this point, if today was a filming day, I would sit down to film. That's where I currently am, I'm in my filming room, but I'm actually not filming any sit down videos today. I have that tomorrow. Um, but I thought I would just give you guys a little like peek at what my room looks like at the moment. So when you walk in, this is what you see. It's a crazy mess. Um, this is where I sit and film my videos. This is my little background. I have a new addition to my background. This is my little troll friend um, from my lovely troll tribe member, Emily G. It's so freaking cute. So this is what my little background looks like. This is what my workstation looks like. It's kind of messy right now, but yeah, this is like what I see when I'm filming. I look out this way. This is my streaming setup over here. I have a whole like, mound of stuff that I have to film a haul for. I'll probably do that tomorrow. I've got my PC over here and then this is just a complete mess over there. I really need to clean that up. Um, and then here's where I have my little hashtag troll tribe plaque. I don't know what to call this, <laughs> but it's so freaking cute. I love it. So yeah, normally that's what I would do, but since I'm not filming any sit down videos today, I have a little bit of free time. So I'm actually going to go ahead and read some of Midnight Sun. I'm so excited about it. Like I mentioned earlier, um, I seriously am not much of a reader. I haven't read like a book in probably years, I want to say. Um, so the fact that I read twice in two days I'm very impressed with myself so this one I think it's like 600 something pages so I think I'm gonna go um, lay down slash sit down and read for a little while and then I will check back in with you we have to go to the post office later to drop off some packages um, for giveaway winners and then I have to go to my PO box and pick I think I have a package there as well but first let's go ahead and check on our plants, our little fiddly fig here is looking pretty rough. Um, it definitely needs some water. So I'm gonna go ahead and water the plants that need to be watered. These actually have a little bit too much water. Um, these are my little succulents. I moved them over here. This isn't where they belong. Um, let's see if I can pick this up. No, I cannot pick this up with one hand. I moved all of these plants over here because when it rains, um, this stuff gets like soaking wet um, and these are already like kind of overwatered. but the sun only hits like on this table in the morning so I need to move them back so that they can get sun. Um, but hopefully they don't die. The, the uh, soil's pretty moist, <laughs> pretty damp so I need these to dry up a little bit so that all of my plants don't die. This one here is thriving. Like all of this new growth is crazy. That one is doing so good. I've had this one for like years and I would never water it or like give it sunlight and it was looking basically dead but it really came back to life so 
Here are all of my plants. Um, this one's looking a little dry. I've got a little aloe. She's kind of struggling, but hopefully she comes out okay. And then I have this one here, so time to take care of my plants. All right, so we're going to the post office to drop off three boxes, uh, two giveaways, and then one uh, work of charity from Paige to somebody. Don't say that. <laughs> Jarvis is such a gentleman, and he just took the packages inside for me. Like he said, I think two of those were giveaways, and then one of them is just like a box of stuff that I'm sending to someone. Um, and yeah, after this, we're gonna go to my PO box. My camera battery's about to die, so I might have to switch over to my phone. All right guys, we are back at the apartment. We dropped off those packages and then picked these ones up at my P.O. box. And I actually think that I'm going to close out the vlog. I am exhausted. I was super productive today. I'm honestly proud of myself. I got a ton of stuff done. Some days are more productive than others, but I had a lot of fun bringing you guys along with me. And I definitely would like to do it again. Like my days vary day to day. So like every single day is different. Duh, that's what I just said. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I thought it was really fun. I definitely want to do this again. So thank you guys so much for watching Thank you again to thread up for partnering with me on today's video And don't forget to click the link in my description box and use code page for an extra 30% off your thread up order Literally insane like I cannot get over it I have to go organize all the clothes that I got into my closet, but I freaking love this outfit that I have on today like seriously you guys I think it's so cute like I love the jeans love the top it's like it's kind of like a sweater but like not since it's short sleeved I don't know I just think it's really cute so yeah so that was today's video thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe and give it a thumbs up I love you guys so so much I hope you all have a wonderful day and I will see you in the next one bye